Almost every day, we hit a bump in the road, quite literally, right? Yeah. Sometimes it's a pothole, but other times it's a manhole cover. <laughs> maybe it's too high, maybe yeah. it's too low. Mm -hmm. And that had Bruce from Eden Prairie and many others of you over the years asking, well, then why aren't the manholes flush with the street? So this was the good question, and you actually had a chance, Heather, to go out mm -hmm. and speak with a representative from the city of Minneapolis, one of the workers yeah. who does this work. Yeah. Um, so what is under the street? What is under these manhole covers? A lot of people may not necessarily know. The Ninja Turtles. <laughs> that, that, that's what I was going to say. And hopefully a good pizza yeah. down there. A yeah. good pizza good down pizza. there? Is, is Shredder down there too? Yeah. With yep, Casey yep, yep. Jones and yeah, all of them? Yeah, they lifted up, they lifted up the 205 pound manhole cover for us. And that's a, that's, that was yep. surprising to me. Yeah. <laughs> I was like, they are that heavy. The way they did it, if you haven't had a oh chance to go and see the story, yeah. WCCO.com slash good question, <laughs> but. Takes a sledgehammer. A sledgehammer. <laughs> and then they kind of pull it off there. Yeah, yeah, it was it was crazy. Uh, no, for real, the, all this all the stuff that we need to run the cities are under our streets because it's the public right away. So you got storm sewer, you got sanitary sewer, you got gas, you got electric, you got water. Everything's under there, and the manholes are the only way you can get there. So why are they in the middle though? Right, and these are, these, these things are fifty years old, mm -hmm. hundred years old. They've been there for a long time. But mm -hmm. the idea is they go right in the middle, so they uh, traffic doesn't run over them. So they're mm -hmm. in between the lanes, right? Okay. Um, it's also a way for the trucks because the trucks have to repair, they have to do maintenance, they can park in the middle of the road, they don't have to worry about cars that are parked on the side or bikes snow or yeah. bikes mm -hmm. or anything like that. But another reason too is that here in Minnesota, in most communities in Minnesota, the homeowners are responsible for the sewer line that yeah. runs from their home to the street. Mm -hmm. And if you put the sewer line on the even side of the street, then the even folks have a lot less to pay to get to their sewer line sure. than the odd right. folks. So you want to keep it you want to keep it in the middle. But yeah. really it, the idea is they don't want people driving over these over sure. these manholes. It's not great for them. And yeah. the question you see, it felt like you got a lot that you talked about before is yeah. how come they're not level? Why are they why, why do, do they bump? kind of dip? Yeah. Why do we bump? Yeah. Why do we bump? Uh, well, I don't know if you've uh, been to Minnesota in the winter <laughs> and then in the summer, AJ. Always, uh, the, always, always um, the weather. If anything yeah, down the weather. And man. it's always the weather. We just can always blame Riley. But we can't blame Riley for the sand and the salt, yeah. though. Uh, uh, but we need the sand. We need the salt there. And that de that can degrade the manhole, mm -hmm. can cause it to sink. The other thing, too, is, you know, they go out and they fix the roads for us. They have to sure. fix the yeah, potholes right. that come. So if they resurface or they repair and they don't lift up the manholes or lower them down the covers, uh, then you're going to get spots where it's just boom, 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 boom. There are ways to do it. So it, this is news you can use here. Uh, if you have a very problematic manhole that you keep going over and mm -hmm. it's creating damage for you, call 311. Uh, they can come out. They can check it out. There are things. They can add little rings on the cover uh -huh. to make it higher or make, make it, it lower. Make it even. Yeah. yeah. I mean, but there's 50,000 manholes just lot. in the city of well, Minneapolis. Wow. That doesn't count like the Excel Energy manholes, sure, some right. of the other ones. Yeah. So you may need to be a little patient. Patient. Yeah. Uh, patient. That's, so none of this infrastructure is more than 100 years And you years didn't get old. to go down the manhole, did you? No, See, I, I wanted to go down the manhole, but it's it's wise that I didn't. You do need actual OSHA training to go down the manhole. The tight space. You mean you actually have to know what you're doing? Yeah, it's shocking. It's shocking <laughs> that the city of Minneapolis was like, I don't think that's a great idea for you. <laughs> okay. Did you look down and were like, eh, that's a little scary looking? Well, there once he took it, the initially when he took the cover off, there was a there was a scent. Oh, there was a scent. Okay. That was my next um, question. Yeah, and and he wow. said he says to us, I say, well, can we stick our GoPro down in there? And he's like, yeah. Yeah, but just know where it goes when you drop it. And I was like, okay, you're right. <laughs> Ryan, you're, you're going down next. You got to do the forecast, but you're going down next. Oh, great. <laughs> Can't wait for that one.